Hey, how you doing? This is Peter with the McKernan Group. Want to talk to you a little bit about, uh, it's January 2022. What do we see in the next like 12 months or 18 months? Like what the market's going to do? I know a lot of people are like, okay, what's going to happen with the market? Time out. Am I, you know, am I good to buy a primary residence? Do you think it's going to go down? Because I know I've, I've had a lot of clients buy and hold, buy and, uh, buy and hold. And then I've had a lot of clients buy a property or buy a property a couple of years ago then sell it last year and then they're holding for a while or they sold it three years ago and they're still holding waiting for that crash um so obviously i don't have a crystal ball and i know a lot of people are like well i can't really you know judge what's going to happen in the next 12 months but what we kind of see is we still have low inventory and the forbearance that we had that was going on um back when COVID hit um that's that's really we thought that or at least people told us that we we're going to have some type of influx of foreclosures well appreciation has really helped those sellers um in or those homeowners in the fact that um, now it's 15 percent more than what you know ultimately it was worth two years ago 20 percent, 25 percent, depending on the market so they have enough equity so they can just go sell it they can you know catch up on all the the um the debts the fees and everything else that they owed and still walk away with money and then go buy something else or they can keep it and then get you know ultimately caught up with that forbearance that they had so i don't really see a huge massive increase in foreclosures even you know i get phone calls where it's like hey sign up for this program because you know there's foreclosures coming ultimately that wasn't really the case um at the end of the day you know there was um, people that were a little worried about that. They had some, you know, struggles, especially with COVID when it first came around. But what do we see in the next 12 months is, is not a big foreclosure, you know, wave. Um, I think that we'll see a little bit of a market adjustment, not price, but with inventory coming back a little bit. And that would be nice to have because I have, I'm working with a lot of buyers that are really just putting their hands up and saying we're going to wait a little while because we keep submitting offers and getting beat out so that's something that's you know pretty tough for for clients especially when they keep getting let down each time we submit an offer so the next 12 months it's it's still gonna you know the market's still gonna go up we're still gonna have appreciation and i think the inventory is going to come back just a little bit i don't think it's going to be you know we're going to have you know in orange county specifically 10,000 properties on the market but we will have you know a few thousand to 5,000, you know, as it goes up. And I think, you know, the months of inventory right now are at like one and a half to two. I think it may go to like three, three and a half, but nothing crazy. And it'll, it'll help out those buyers that are still looking and wanting to try to get in with the low down payments like FHA and VA loans. So um, things to think about over the course of 2022. Um, especially if you're if you're looking around, if you have some questions, leave them below, or you can also send us an email or go onto our website, and you can shoot us a message there too. Thanks for watching.